You know if someone is named Vanilla, she's going to be the greatest snack. Vanilla ice cream, vanilla cake, vanilla center. You love to hear it. One of the most popular flavors in the world. Listen, Chief, she's an upcoming must food center. Her flavor will enhance the taste of your team compositions. Whatever you do, the main reason is you have to pull her is to reunite her with her long lost sisters. Listen, Chief, look closely how look how lonely Drea and Mantis are. You got this, Chief. And secondly, Vanilla is a strong, muscular woman who can beat up tugs and corruptors. Chief, who would dare and kidnap you with her around, you will finally be safe, I can guarantee it. She even has a gigantic mecha at her disposal. Come on, Chief. With her around, even Paradiso's special hush units will tremble at mere sight. Fun information. Did you know Vanilla in mythology is often associated with love and fertility? Wink wink, Chief. How can you not pull for her after knowing this? The dream team compositions would be wild too. Imagine a team with Vanilla, Drea, Mantis and Nox. And obviously, two more filler centers to round up the team. Insane powerhouse. Thistle. She's either Kokolik's daughter or Coco's granddaughter. Who knows, but regardless, Chief, save her. Pull her. Reunite her with Garden. Thistle has the greatest glow up yet. Man, what can a heartbreak do to a person? Did Christina break up with Thistle? Did Christina show her the cold shoulder? I need to find out at all costs. Take a look at this, Chief. Thistle before MBCC? Thistle after MBCC. I smell drama in the air. Or maybe Thistle is just having a face. Regardless, look how cute the Minos Bureau of Cat Control is. Do it for them. But seriously, the fact that we are still getting garden content after the first anniversary and the latest main story update is freaking amazing. I love garden so much. Thistle, the Umbra assassin. Most people will probably try and build a fire team around her, but listen chief, why make a fire team when you can make a garden team? Thistle, Coco, Garofano, Sumire, Kika Bijan, and a special guest, Thistle's girlfriend, Christina. First came Darren, then Shalom, after that Coco became the ultimate limited sinner and now we are graced with fire goddess Yao. Chief, I'm speechless. News S rank Fury Sinner Limited. Big exclamation mark, limited. You should always pull for limited, otherwise you might have to wait a very long time for them to come back. Yao has one of the quirkiest kids I've ever seen. Using her ultimate ability, she sacrifices a sinner. What? She kills a fellow sinner. I'm lost for words. Becoming a dual wielding beast, a phoenix. We are finally getting a magic fury. Pakasi won't be the only one anymore, finally. Her design is insanely cool, I love it. Though I can't wait for her story debut. Since she's the half anniversary sinner with Duo Ro, the event's going to be amazing. Beyond amazing. Beyond discards did not disappoint. In fact, it's one of my most favorite events ever and I'm super hyped for this one too. Duo Ro Chief. I have been waiting for ages for someone like her. Chief, you don't understand. I love martial arts, manga, manhwa, manhua, whatever you want to call them. Immortal fiction is so much fun. I'm literally obsessed with them. And now an immortal cultivator is in path to nowhere. Must pull, must save. Chief, let me explain to you. In simple terms, in case you don't read these types of stories. Chief, you are getting a martial older sister. Chief, you are so blessed. Two older sisters. One is from the underground and now you even have an immortal sister. Time to create a MBCC sect to rule over the city. Duro is a catalyst who can heal and revive a sinner. Oh my god, I can see the Bombo combo from miles away. Yao sacrifices a sinner and Duro revives a sinner. Wow, what a deadly combination. Pull for both chief. Start saving, it's going to be a costly endeavor. I am so hyped for Duro, like she resonates with me so much, you know, her design, her uh, aesthetic and her, yeah, just like I said, you know, I love martial arts manga, you know, stories like that. It's so much fun. I can't get enough you know I i'm reading them every day because god i'm i'm so obsessed i am so obsessed cute gives me avu vibes she's going to be a super fun character a class can't wait reticle pew pew sinner from the looks of it we are going to have a very wholesome moment with chief duro and yan yan prepare lots of dishes chief we are about to create another river path to nowhere events always hit hard in the fields i hope in the future we could get avu and yan yan accompanying chief it would be a hilarious journey for sure full of laughter and happiness yan yan a class rank sinner you know the drill every a class is free for us i love path to nowhere man we are getting all all the A class for free, man. Chief, this S rank sin is crazy. The fandom has been up in flames over her. With a single glance, she stole the hearts of many. Angel is a S rank Umbra sinner. I don't know what's the story behind her, but I feel like many chiefs unlock the Stockholm syndrome. Look, okay, I can't blame you. Angel is so hot and domineering. With a single glance, she stole my heart too. If the spoiler images told me anything, it's that we are in for an insane ride. We might be getting the most romantic story ever. So romantic, even Shalom is going to be jealous of Angel. The rumors was 
spread in the MBCC and every sinner will go wild. Man, she really is giving us biker gang leader vibes, but she's an assassin. Man, I have a soft spot for assassins. Ever since we got Sumir's interrogation and Baxter during our coma chief, I have fallen deep into the rabbit hole. I don't know why, but for some reason I'm picturing an Assassin's Creed game where the main character would be Angel on her mission to save you, chief, from the Templars. Is this who Hela befriended outside of MBCC? I can see her vibing with Hela all day. She looks cool, she looks fun. I mean A-class, right? So we are getting her for sure. You know, just for playing the story, the event and... Yeah, it's going to be great. We are so close to greatness, guys. Like, holy shit. So many cool sinners. I mean, the past sinners were so cool and now we're getting more, even cooler sinners. Man, it's great. I hope you are excited as me, man. We're getting Vanilla, Tistel, Yao, Duruo, Yanyan, Angel, Golan. Oh my god, so many amazing sinners. Okay, Vanilla, you know, we have to pull, okay? We have to pull, we have to reunite her with her sisters, man, with Mantis, with Drea, Tistel, okay? You know, Garden, Coco's daughter, Coco's granddaughter, either one, doesn't matter. Christina's uh, girlfriend. A Yao, limited sinner, you know, limited, must pull, there's not much to say. Duro, okay, amazing, senior, older sister, come on man, martial artist, you, you love to see it. Yan Yan, cute like Avu, we're getting her for free, a rank sinners, you know, for just playing the story, we get her for free, love it, love it. Angel, okay, got the entire Path to Nowhere fandom in chokehold, <laughs> there's really not much to say, honestly, you have to see it for yourself, you know, how, cr how the fandom uh, reacted when she was first, you know, <laughs> showed to us, but it's crazy. Golden A rank center, we're getting her free. Guys, see you next time.